Good morning, Fish Pond. How is everyone this morning? I hope you all had a wonderful spring break with your families and that you were able to get outside. I've seen several of you riding your bicycles and going for walks. I think that's wonderful. It's a great way to enjoy the season that we're in. And we're going to talk about that in just a minute. But first, how do we always start our circle time? With the Rise and Shine song. So everybody stand up, okay? All right. Rise and shine and welcome to school today. Rise and shine and welcome to school today. Rise and shine and welcome to school today. We're so glad you're here. And we are. Now, before we get any further, we have something very important to do together as a class. We had a really special birthday over spring break. And we didn't get a chance to sing to our special birthday friend. So can we all do that together? You'll sing with me? Oh, great, because it was Miss Amber's birthday. Everyone get ready, let's sing on the count of three. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Miss Amber. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Miss Amber. We love you so much. <laughs> okay. Remember earlier when I mentioned the beautiful season that we're enjoying? Do you know what the four seasons are? Winter, spring, summer, and fall. Which season are we in right now? Spring. That's why we just had spring break. That's why you see all the turtles and alligators swimming in the ponds again. That's why you see all the beautiful flowers starting to grow. Spring is the time when everything comes to life in a beautiful, colorful way. God did that just for us so that we could enjoy his creation. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> I think so too. So let's sing a song about something that happens in the spring, about how flowers grow, like the ones on my shirt. All right? So let's start out way down here on the floor. Curl up like a tiny seed, a tiny seed, a tiny seed. The warm sun is what you need. Now you can start growing. Drink the rain and start to rise, and start to rise, and start to rise. Stretch up tall, arms open wide. Now your flower's showing. Good job. Now I've got some exercise poses for us to do, some yoga poses for us to do that all have to do with the spring. First of all, what's something that you see fluttering around in the air a lot these days? Not the birds. Butterflies. So let's all sit down on our bottoms. Put your feet together. You can hold your toes if you want to. And make your butterfly wings go up and down. Oh, you're beautiful butterflies out there. Good job. All right. Now, if we want to start a garden, what do we need to put into the ground? Seeds. So, let's become seeds. Start like this. Put your bottom on your feet. Curl up small and stretch your arms up behind you. And now you're a little seed. I wonder what vegetable or flower you're going to become. Speaking of flower, sit on your bottom, stretch your legs out in front of you with your knees bent, tuck one elbow under one knee, tuck the other elbow under the other knee, and if you can, rise up, and you're a flower. How beautiful. What else do we have? What lives 
in our garden. It's brown and kind of slimy. It kind of crawls like this. It's a worm. So let's lay on our tummies. Here's how you can become a worm. Push your upper body back and put your bottom in the air. Just like a worm. Very good. Now, those seeds that we just planted, what happens if it doesn't rain for a few days? We need to water them. So let's get our, let's get our watering cans ready, okay? Stand up tall. Reach your arms way up into the air and fold forward towards your toes, like so. Now let the water come out, just like this. Sprinkle water all over those seeds. Very good. All right, we've got one more to do. The trees have beautiful leaves coming this time of year. There are two ways that you can do the tree pose. The easiest way is to just tuck your foot right here at your ankle and keep your hands close. If you've got really good balance, you can pull your foot up a little higher or even, <laughs> my balance is struggling this morning, all the way up and spread your branches way, way out. Look up and catch some sun. Very good. Thank you, friends. You did such a nice job with all of those spring things. Now, what month is it? It's one of the spring months. Does anybody know? Let's sing our months of the year song and maybe you can figure it out. January, February, March, April, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. These are the months of the year. So what month is it? It's April. What a wonderful spring month it is. <laughs> now I've got some stories and I'm gonna bring you close in just a minute but I'm not gonna make the camera wobble around all this time. So check back my, at my other videos so that you can see the great books that I have picked out for you today, okay? We'll end this part of the circle time with our prayer. Let's do God our Father. One hand up, one hand up. Put them together and bring them down. God our Father, God our Father, we thank you, we thank you for many blessings, for many blessings. Amen. Amen. All right, friends, make sure you check out the stories I'm posting, okay? Goodbye.